Welcome to this tutorial showing how to fill in missing data or blank cells in a few click in Excel. It is a very common issue when the data was acquired from a pivot table or if you have blank cells preventing you from performing calculations. So let's go over an example to see how we can fill in all the missing cells within a few clicks. This is our data, clearly copied and pasted from a pivot table. Visually, it is very easy to read. For the first row of data, it contains all of the values, the quarter, the month, the product, and the sales amount. However, for the second row, we are missing the quarter and the month. Excel will not understand that the value belongs to Q1 for the month of January. So let's fix our data. Let's select the two columns we want to fix without the headers, it is important. And now, under the Home menu in the Excel ribbon, choose Find and Select, go to Special, Blanks in the new menu, and click OK. Now, only the blank cells are selected. Let's go to the formula bar and type equals and now because we have two columns we're going to select the first row of data from the two columns in our case B11 to C11. We're not going to press enter to validate the formula instead we're going to use a combination of two keys control enter and now all of the values are populated You'll notice that for the first row, it is still hard-coded, and for the second row, we now have a formula. So in case you don't like the mix of hard-coded values and formulas, you can copy and paste special your data, choosing values. It will get rid of the formulas. You can use the same technique to replace missing value within a field. Let's say this is now our data source. For the product, we are missing a few values. We want to replace the missing cells by miscellaneous. Same thing, let's select our data. Let's go to Find and Select, go to Special, Blanks, clicking on OK. And now in the formula bar, typing miscellaneous. Control enter. And now the two cells have been updated to reflect miscellaneous. That was pretty easy. And that's how you fill in missing data or blank cells in Excel. Thanks for watching.